who is psychotic and bipolar and hearing voices of Olivia Newton-John and Barry White goes and fills up their vehicle, their rented vehicle, with gas before returning it. I mean, Vicki Ziegler, have you... <laughs> No. I mean, come on. First of all, is the guy married? He has children. Is anyone going to testify that this guy's in La La Land and she'd be married to someone as crazy as this? That's not the case. He was a boss. He worked. He had employees. She was one of them. Schneiderman. So, I mean, no one has a, a, at least corroborated his position. Unless there's going to be some doctor that says, yes, he's been treated, and, and yes, he is crazy, and he's insane, and these, these delusional episodes happen once in a while. Not gonna happen. Pat Brown, you're shaking your head. <laughs> oh, but this is not having an off day. This is somebody who very may well have an alcohol problem. And when you're an alcoholic, and I speak as a recovering alcoholic with 16 and hopefully in April 17 years of sobriety, you repeat the behavior over and over again. Uh, most parents would never in a million years allow their child behind the wheel, particularly when they were drunk. I wish all fathers were as attentive, loving, and careful as Sean Weimer. Now, that does not mean to say that you can excuse what he did. And it just so happens that this particular wrong, and it may be the worst thing he's ever done, was caught on video and made a worldwide sensation. Vicki Ziegler, 10 seconds. Let me tell you, Jane, he pled guilty to and he pled guilty based on the fact that he wouldn't go to jail. This is a, up to a four-year jail sentence. He should have been- It's wrong. Terrible.